Nearly after a month of relative calm, Yemen's Houthi rebels have now claimed responsibility on Saturday for striking the Andromeda Star oil tanker in the Red Sea, part of their ongoing targeting of commercial vessels in solidarity with Palestinians amid the Gaza conflict. Also, a MQ-9 Reaper drone was also shot down. The ship reportedly sustained damage as reported by its owner and confirmed by the British maritime security firm Ambray. The Houthi spokesperson Yahya Sari identified the Panama-flagged vessel as British-owned, yet shipping records reveal a recent ownership change to CHLA's registered entity engaged in a Russia-related trade travelling from Primorsk, Russia to Wadinar, India, according to the AMRE. Since November 2023, Iran-backed Houthi rebels have conducted frequent drone and missile attacks in the Red Sea, Babel Mandeb Strait and the Gulf of Aden too. These assaults prompted cargo ships to seek alternative, costly routes to southern Africa, raising concern about regional destabilization amid Israel-Hamas war. This attack on Andromeda Star follows a brief pause in Houthi operations targeting vessels linked to Israel, the US and the UK. Notably, the US's Dwight D. Eisenhower aircraft carrier recently exited the Red Sea via Suez Canal, concluding its mission in safeguarding the commercial shipping. But now the attacks have resumed and it has taken the world by a shock. This escalation also coincides with the Houthi statement issued a few days ago via Instagram on Monday, vowing to heighten assault on Zionist navigation across the Red Sea and Arabian Sea and also the Indian Ocean. While the US and UK airstrikes have reportedly weakened Houthi capabilities, this underlying cause for recent attacks remain unclear. However, this attack also raises concern about a multi-layered problem for the Middle East in the making as tensions continue to escalate. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.